Hi there. Welcome to Techie Toys. The purpose of this instructional video is to show you just how quick and easy it is to set up your jumping bug. The only thing that you will need to set up the jumping bug is a small Phillips screwdriver to open the battery compartment and a fresh set of new four AA alkaline batteries. We suggest taking everything out of the box before you begin. Your parts list is as follows. Module with bug, front foot, back foot, side feet, and foot removal key. First, insert the front foot into the bottom of the module with bug until it locks into place, matching A to A. Next, insert the back foot into the bottom of the module with bug until it locks into place, matching B to B. Insert the side feet into the bottom of the module with bug until they lock into place, matching C to C. Make sure that each foot is flush with the rectangular base. To remove the foot, insert the plastic key into the holes on the bottom of the foot. Twist and pull to release the locks. When needed, add weight or tape down the feet. This will increase the overall stability. Next, lift the bug wrapped in fabric until the poles are vertical. Making sure the poles are completely vertical, attach the two springs. Please use caution when doing so. The tension in the springs is very strong. Also, make sure the springs are secure on the peg when attaching the springs to the pole. If you are using the 6 volt 2 amp DC adapter, you will need to remove any demo batteries and replace the battery compartment cover. Plug the adapter into the DC adapter jack on top of the module. Plug the other end into a power outlet. If using batteries, remove any demo batteries and insert four brand new AA alkaline batteries into the battery compartment. Do not turn on the jumping bug until setup is complete. Next, release the tie holding the fabric and locate the hook and loop fasteners underneath. Attach them to the hook and loop fasteners located on all four feet. Lastly, spread out the fabric and pose the legs as desired. Your setup is now complete. Make sure there are no obstructions to hinder jumping bugs movement. Make sure to place the jumping bug on level ground to ensure the best operation. Turn the switch on the module to the on position to operate in sound and motion activation mode. Make a loud sound or move in front of the item to activate. Be sure to leave the switch in the off position when not in use. If you have the foot pad, which is sold separately, connect the plug carefully to the jack marked foot pad located on the module. Place the foot pad in front of your jumping bug. Place the switch on the module into the foot pad position to enable foot pad activation. Step on the foot pad to activate. For more information, visit our website at techietoys.com and click on customer support for other helpful tips and troubleshooting. Also available are downloadable instructions and product setup videos. You can also click on the item to find where to purchase additional optional equipment, such as foot pad triggers for activation and replacement DC adapters. Thank you, and happy haunting!